gotta wear your leopard onesie somewhere. Good morning guys, happy Sunday. Hi, what time is it? It is 7.30 and I'm finally able to vlog because it's daylight, but I was up at about 6.30 this morning getting some uh, last minute things ready for the video that goes live today and watch the news, had my coffee. <laughs> kind of like my morning routine. Just kind of want to check in with you guys this morning. Um, I've got a call at 10 and then I have a Facebook Live with my Life by Her girls um, on our Facebook group at 11 and then I will touch back, touch back in, touch back in, check back in <laughs> with you guys and just let you know like what we're doing for the rest of the day. Cool things to talk about. Um, one kind of like big thing that I'm excited about. Why do you like, why can't you just let me talk to my people here? later than when I last talked to you guys. I just went and did a quick workout, showered up, and um, now I'm about to have a cheat meal because it's Sunday, and I'll explain to you after I cook and eat my food why I have a cheat meal and what exactly this means to me. So, stay tuned. So I'm about to make something, I'm about to be Chef Ashley, and I'm gonna make something really awesome. And I wasn't gonna do this till later tonight, but this actually got here sooner than expected, so I'm gonna do it now. And um, Sun Basket actually sponsored this part of the video. And here is my lovely box. Sun Basket is a meal kit delivery service, and they send organic and sustainable produce right to your front door. And the reason I love this is because for the first time, I don't have to substitute anything because they offer vegan, options. Um, I think they do paleo, vegan, vegetarian, so like any type of need that you might have for your lifestyle is met, which is really cool. Before I've had to like take the cheese out and it just kind of ruins the whole thing. So it's nice to have like a vegan option. I know everything um, is perfect for my diet, so all good. They also do um, gluten-free and like family style as well, so you can um, order for your family. If you have a larger family, obviously it's just Ryan and I, so it's just, this is just for two people. That being said, there's actually like 18 different recipes to choose from, so you're bound to find something that you like out of 18. I had such a hard time picking, but I actually picked the, this little, this little catalog of everything, eggplant lasagna with white beans and baby greens. I mean, I'm starving, so I cannot make this fast enough. So there might be a change of plans. I actually just realized that they sent me pita pockets too, and so, I don't know. What do you think, Rye? Eggplant lasagna or the pita pockets? Pita pockets. Pita pockets? Hold on, I'm gonna go study this. I'll be right back. I decided to go with the pita pockets because the bread looked just so good, so that's what I'm doing. But, I mean, like, how good do these veggies look? Um, they actually work with the best organic farms to provide, like, the freshest and organic produce that's out there, so it's really good kind of knowing where all of these fresh vegetables are actually coming from. what they look like and I am cannot wait. I already tried the, the filling earlier and it's so good. You can either go to the description box below or go to sunbasket.com slash Ashley to get slash Ashley, that's a tongue twister, <laughs> to get $35 off of your first order. Damn, I'm gonna eat these now, bye. I just picked up a little bit. The apartment is so smoky still from the food that I cooked. I coconut oil, every time I burn coconut oil, 
Like it doesn't smell as bad as olive oil, but it makes my apartment 10 times smokier. So I don't know. So I turn the fan on to like get, get it circulating. And yes, this is the third time I've changed clothes today because we're about to go, we're leaving. So I had changed. Before we leave, I thought I would just tell you guys that I hired a trainer slash nutrition coach and I am on my first full week. You're probably wondering why I hired a trainer slash fitness coach. How I found out about him and what gave me the motivation to hire this person. Um, Ryan actually hired him about a month before we went to Mexico. Ryan worked his ass off for a month straight. Um, gym twice a day, eating tons and tons of food, just like kicking ass. Like, and his I mean, his body like transformed within a month. It was insane how hard he worked and like his results. So I decided that I would reach out to this person that Ryan's working with and work with him also. And you know, when he asked me what my goals were, my goal is I wanna gain, I wanna gain weight, I wanna gain muscle, I wanna make sure that I'm eating enough, I wanna know my macros and make sure that I'm hitting them every day. I hired him too and I started a week ago today. And I am doing um, fasted cardio in the morning three times a week and I know that this is for fat loss and people are like, why are you doing that? Why are you doing fasted cardio? And you know, he says it's for basic digestive health and just overall um, health. I am eating so much throughout the day. It is insane. I'm eating um, four large meals plus three protein shakes a day and no sugar. Um, no sugar at all. I can't even have berries, like, at all. It's so hard for me because you guys know how much I love sweets and I love cupcakes and stuff like that. So, on Sundays, I get to have, um, like, sugar and unhealthy stuff. Okay, I shouldn't say that. I don't get a cheat day. I get a cheat, um, meal. So, that is why I did Sun Basket today and why we're going to get cupcakes. Because um, I'm putting all this stuff on Insta stories and everyone's like, why did you have a trainer? Why are you doing fasted cardio? And I was like, oh my God, I guess I just need to like come out and ex explain what I'm doing. But, but I'm really, really excited. You know, I've always been a little self-conscious about my weight um, just because I am so skinny and I literally, I eat so much food and I just don't gain weight. And I've, I've always been like that. And it, and of course, you know, when people rub it in my face in the YouTube comments, it's, it sucks. But that's not the reason that I'm doing this. I'm doing this for my own, my own well-being and my own um, personal help and personal development. And I've hired someone who really knows what they're talking about and is really, really, really good and so attentive. I've seen his results, his before and afters. So I bought the three-month plan from him. And I did a lot of research before I, I chose somebody, but after seeing like Ryan's results and what Ryan's doing, I just was like copycat and, and grabbed this guy from Ryan. First of all, today I can barely even move. I'm so sore. Um, just from lifting weights, I'm like so sore and I'm just constantly so full and miserable every single day. But I feel like your stomach gets used to that much food after a while. It's a lot of like rice, quinoa, greens, tons and tons of proteins, um, tofu, tempeh, a lot of pea protein because my stomach gets a little weird if I have too much soy. So I'm trying to alternate between the two. So yeah, you will be seeing um, some more workout videos um, in the vlogs. You will not be seeing a whole lot of cooking because I am eating pretty much the same thing like every single day. Yeah, so I just kind of wanted to tell you guys what, what I've been up to in that fitness world. How it goes, I, I will post a before and after um, at the end of the three months so you guys can see hopefully there's some, um, you know, weight gain in all the right places and stuff like that. But now it is Sunday. I've been looking forward to this day all week. I'm going to get some damn cupcakes. Hey, I don't care if it's raining or not. We are going to storage. Nah. Ryan? Nah. Ryan. Fine, I'm going to go by myself. <laughs> all right. Ready? We Where... put that in your backpack. Yeah. Do you like how I have my boob pads right here? My backless bra? Yeah, it's for our guests that come over. No, I just washed it. It's just, just so they can see I just set it here to dry. The inner workings of the boob life. It's cleaning day. Just open the door to oh. our groceries. <laughs> okay. All right. Why is there a beneficial dog food? This 100% is not ours. 
Yeah, we do not wear that. But this is ours. This has our name on it. What? Um, toilet paper. This is ours, but we didn't get our paper towels. Yeah, so when you order Amazon Fresh, they use a reusable tote, so you just set it outside your door. And on your next order, they pick it up for you. I'm thinking you're super cool. In that leopard jacket. You know, bro. I saw this chick in the gym the other day in a leopard onesie jumpsuit, but it was gym clothes. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Maybe she was doing yoga. She was very ready to work out, like, like look at me, yeah. but she just sat there for most of the time. Well, she got to wear your leopard onesie somewhere. You might I like where her head was at, though. She was there to work, like, in outfit, not so much in, like, actual <laughs> practice. Are your calves so sore? My calves are always sore. My calves have never You just been have to sore. learn to live with daily sore calves. I can barely reach the top shelf anyway, so now I double can't reach it because I can't get on my toes. <laughs> oh, don't be weird. Shh. Okay, we're gonna get one each. No, 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 no. We got two cookies, three cupcakes, one raspberry bar, and I'm probably gonna get a cupcake to go in when we leave. <laughs> Jamie, if you're watching this. No, don't tell Jamie. Jamie's not watching this. Do they have little plates? I mean, I'm fine eating off my napkin, but maybe I want a plate. I don't know. Cookies and cream? We've moved on. We proceeded on? No. Touch the table. You still gotta eat it. No. Five second rule, bro. No, I do not live by that rule. Well. You know what? Hold on. You live a very frightened life, don't you, ma'am? <laughs> Strawberries, like, always my favorite. Right. So good. Bueno. I wasn't gonna get any cupcakes to go because I just ate so many and then I ended up getting two to go. And Jenna, I got Jenna two cookies because she loves them. And Ryan got a cupcake. Oh, I forgot to tell you, when I was up there, they do have chocolate cupcakes. Okay, carrot cake all the way. We're just gonna, we're just gonna forget about it? Oh, okay, okay. Oh, yeah, this is what we're leaving with. We're headed to this skincare place called Credo, and they sell all cruelty free skincare products and makeup too, right? I believe so. I don't know. I haven't been in there, but I'm excited to go in because a lot of you guys have been telling me about it. Is there a reason I'm not under the umbrella right now? Oops. Wait, my hand is literally burning off. Oh. Just know that if you go to Little Cupcake Bake Shop and get a tea, the you, won't, tea you won't be able to drink it for two hours. Hottest tea in New York City. Hottest tea in New York City. I'm awarding them right now. And that says a lot, because I've had tea from everywhere. Ryan, I want to move in this neighborhood. Uh... No comment? Okay, bye. covered in moisturizer and skin balm. Now we are headed back down to Prince Street where Little Cupcake Bake Shop was and we're going to one of our favorite bookstores. It's like a local, a local bookstore. I think most of the books are used. It's really cute and whenever we're down here, we always make a little pit stop because we love books. Oh, wait. What? I didn't even realize. That's Ryan just found Everlane. It's right there. That's the new, the new store. Do they have men's? They do. 
Spends oh, money. it's really busy. I bet they just opened. So, if you don't know what Everlane is, Everlane's one of the largest, like, sustainable and eco-friendly clothing manufacturers. Yeah. That's fairly large that there is. And if you go on their site, they tell you, like, how much something makes, cost to make, sorry, and then how much of it is a profit for them. That's really cool. Is Everlane bigger than Reformation? I don't know. I know they're very, very fast growing. Yeah. Okay, my arm's hurting. We'll see you at the bookstore. Peace. Read this, huh? But the intermediate campus is still No. And most students live on campus the whole thing. Yeah, it was still about yeah. It's been a few hours since we got back. I pretty much like laid on the couch and edited today's video. We did not go to storage. But I'm gonna take a bath and I'm gonna use this joint and muscle bath oil because I am literally I don't think I've ever been so sore in my entire life. So I'm gonna take a bath, I'm gonna put my drunk elephant baby facial face mask on, and I'm gonna go to bed because I'm super tired. Um, gonna watch a little Manhunter. Manhunter or Manhunt? We just watched Mindhunter and The Punisher. So I'm getting all my Netflix shows confused, but it's the one about the Unabomber. We just started that one a couple of nights ago, so. I'm gonna go so we can watch that, but bye. Good morning. I'm about to go brave the cold. It's snowing like crazy right now. I'll show you outside. Uh. Jenna comes in today, and yeah. this is the <laughs> this is the first time we've seen Jenna since before we left for Mexico because I had strep throat and then she had strep throat. Both illnesses not related at all. Um, we just both had it at the same time. Jenna was nice enough while we were gone to Mexico to stay at our apartment and watch Stella the whole time. Um, so I'm gonna go run to Sephora and get her a gift. And we're actually gonna book her a massage downstairs for tomorrow. She has no idea. So we're gonna surprise her with both of those things today. Um, just a little thank you for, because it's kind of, you know, even though she loves Stella and, um, you know, when you have to like pack and be away from your apartment and it's kind of kind of a pain in the butt. So we were so thankful for her for doing that. Came back and she had like cleaned the whole apartment. She bought me cupcakes that said, congrats on 300K from my favorite cupcake place in my favorite flavor. So she's just like the best human being. Jenna is the best. She is like in the whole world. She is just the best. So I'm gonna go get her a thank you gift and um, put my coat on. We'll see you in a second. Hey, what are you doing? Coffee time. Ryan's like, we drink so much coffee, we have got to get a cheaper coffee. Yeah, like buying this two to three times a week. It's so expensive. Zero cents. Yeah. Stupidity. Yeah. We had a good run for a while though. We did. Good run. And you. Okay, I'm gonna go put my coat on and go. Okay. Okay. It looks so ridiculous right now. Like, you have no idea. I'm also taking this to the donation bin downstairs. I'm sweating. <laughs> I just like threw on an old sweatshirt with like bleach stains on it and my sweatpants and my snow boots. Okay. I look pregnant because my scarf. <laughs> so this is where I put my donation stuff. But uh, someone's moving in so this might be hard. while I was outside because it's pouring rain now, but I got Jenna perfume. I got her the Tom Ford Black Orchid. Um, we were talking about perfume the other day and she said that that was one that she really wanted. So hopefully she hasn't gotten it yet. We have a gift receipt just in case. Have you booked um, her massage yet? Not yet. Okay, we'll call before she gets here. Yay! Anyone deserves it. 
it's Jenna. All right, we are going downtown. I'm gonna get my eyebrows touched up. It's like my um, six week, six week time to get them done. Did I just, English? <laughs> we are going to do that. And we gave Jenna her present today. Just started getting touch up. How does it feel? It feels like a little scratch. Yeah, it doesn't hurt at all. Just like a little sting. Tiny, tiny. I like hear it kind of. You hear it? Yeah. That's great. It's not um it's not the skin, it's um hair. The little needles. Uh-huh. Because they're eleven little needles next to each other, they hit each other. Those are eleven little needles. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh my god, I thought it was like one little scraper. I know, too. <laughs> so talking about a tattoo, I'm getting a tattoo. When? Where? On February twenty sixth. Okay, when with Johnny get? Boy. No way. So no, I don't oh my god. god. Good do they look? Oh my gosh, they're so good. They are on fleek. Thank you. Yay. All the press info below, as well as some tips that she just told me about that you guys will need to know if you get them done. Just got home about an hour ago from. Are you okay? Yeah. What was that? Water. Again? That's probably my fault. Sorry. My face hurts, <laughs> but I love my eyebrows. Perrette just like I mean, she does such an amazing job. Um, we changed the color up. We changed the color up just a little bit, but I'm so happy with them. I'm. We're about to go to the gym. I'm literally wearing a sweatshirt and my Zella leggings because I've eaten like my f like four meals today, and I've had like four protein shakes. So I am like not in a good spot right now. I'd love to have another protein shake after I'm done with the gym. So, I'm not really filming my workouts this week because Ryan is so is nice enough to train me this week, make sure that I'm doing everything properly, all of the workouts that my form is correct. You ready? Yeah. All right, let me get my backpack. All right, bye guys.